What's good sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. Today we are more on the fashion side of the channel. So we are going to talk about how to make outfits with pants. Also before I start, I do want to say stay tuned for the end of the video because I will have full outfit shots to show you guys the different kind of outfits that you guys can have and maybe you guys can build off that. Let me start off by saying don't ever wear any type of Nike runner like this with pants. They do not look good. They just, oh my god. No. Maybe maybe with something more limited, like probably a Dornbecker. But I've seen some people actually rock these with pants. You could at most just pinroll your jeans and it'll look nice. But for the most part, I wouldn't do that. They just This shoe is not really something that you can rock with jeans and look kind of stylish. So this shoe is also a runner. It is an Adidas runner shoe. But the only difference is it is more stylish and it could also be used for performance such as running or working out. All right, so this video is gonna be based off only one pair of jeans, and it is the ones I'm wearing right now, which you guys can see. It is just the ones I wear in basically all my videos. And the reason for that is I don't really own that many pair of jeans because I live in South Florida. It's hot as hell down here. So most of my outfits just contain wearing shorts. Here to the right of me, I have six pairs of shoes on the floor, which I feel are necessary that you must have in your collection in order to get any type of outfit look that you want with jeans. First of all, we do have a bulky shoe. As you guys can see, this shoe is quite bulky. It is like, it's pretty wide. On the top, you can see it's pretty wide as well. This is what I mean by a bulky shoe. It's really thick. You have a bit, really thick sole and it makes your foot look big, even though it's a low top. So let's say a Jordan 3, a Jordan 4, this shoe, anything along those lines. For skinny guys like me, this shoe is gonna be kind of hard to rock because first of all, skinny guys are gonna have skinny ankles and this shoe is going to make your ankles look even skinnier and it's just to make it look awkward as hell. So basically choosing an outfit has to do with your body type as well. But if you're wearing a bulky shoe like this, I recommend you don't pin roll them because like I said, it's going to make you look really skinny. But a shirt to wear with this, if you're wearing pants, is to wear a medium sized fit shirt. Nothing too tight or nothing too loose. Next up, you do have your high tops. This shoe in particular, it is a shoe that just says, I'm feeling kind of lazy today I, or I have that skater look so I'm just going to throw these on. So with this shoe, since it is kind of skinny, you can actually throw in a loose shirt, a medium sized shirt, or a tight fit shirt. It all depends on your style. Me, if I were to wear this, I would wear it with like, maybe a little bit more of a looser shirt because it does go with the style of the shoe. It goes with that skater style. But if you're wearing something like a Jordan 1, then I would go with something like maybe a medium sized fit shirt. And keep in mind for the short guys like me, if you are wearing a high top, it is gonna make you a little bit shorter Next up, you do have your skinny low tops, such as a Yeezy, an NMD, or even an Ultra Boost. The only thing that doesn't make this skinny is the sole. The sole of this shoe is really wide, so it does make the shoe a little bit wide as well. And it also is really thick. But to be honest, Yeezys can be worn with almost anything. With this shoe, you can pin your jeans, or you can just let them down and let the pants hang over the tongue and have the heel tab stick out. I prefer to pin roll them because pin rolling is my thing and also it looks, it has more of a neat look to it. Next one up is your more classy loafers, such as this one is a Calvin Klein. And these I don't wear much, I wear them when I go out to a club or something or ever if you go out to like a business meeting, you can wear them too. But with these, if I were to wear pants, you can wear these with jeans, which really is not recommended. There are people that do that and I would let, depending on your style, you can pin roll them or you can let the jeans down. But this is more of a shoe you wear with dress pants because you are going to dress up in them. And then you do have your casual boat shoes, which I'm pretty sure a lot of people have nowadays. This shoe you can wear with almost anything as well. It looks good mostly with tight shirts because it does, this is more of like a frat look. But if you want to wear them with pants, you can actually pin roll the pants and it'll look good with these shoes as well. Last but not least, it's a type of sneaker that I already spoke about. But this is a sneaker you must have in your collection because this shoe also looks good with anything. You can use them for any occasion as well. And it is an NMD. doesn't matter what kind. I know I have the Prime Knit here, but you could have the Mesh one. You could have the XR one. Most preferably, the R ones are better for any occasions. I don't know why, but they just look so good on anything. You can wear them to the gym. You can wear them to go out. You can wear them to go out to eat go out with your friends. doesn't matter any occasion, except obviously something more classy, and you're not going to wear NMDs there. You're going to wear like classy shoes like the Calvin Klein's that I spoke about. I think the reason it goes with everything is because it's such a simple shoe. It's literally a one-piece upper, and then you do have just a midsole on it and that's it. They have a heel tab and just to help you put it on. Shoelaces, of course, and that's all there is to it. Not too much going on. And also, I think because they're very form-fitting to your foot, especially the prime knits, they will form-fit to your ankle, to the size of your foot, since the prime knit does give 
but the only thing with these I prefer to pin roll the jeans so you can kind of see some ankle and so you don't hide this part of the shoe you still can see it so you can see the whole shoe and shirt wise I would go with a slim fit shirt even though you could probably rock a loose one with it but that's just not me anyways that's enough talking for me guys let me show you guys some ways that I wear my jeans with my sneakers and the different type of shirts that I wear As you guys saw, I really don't wear tank top with jeans because it just doesn't look right. You can wear with shorts because shorts has more of that summer look, which I will get to in another video. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. We are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by April 22nd. And if we do, I will begin a Yeezy giveaway. So keep that in mind, share the videos, and do whatever you gotta do to get this channel to 10,000 subscribers. Make sure you stay woke. Well. Our sneaky sign now. Peace.